We are working the latest on some developing news tonight that we first brought you on Eyewitness News at 6 over on WPRI 12. Former Providence Mayor Buddy Cianci has been released from the hospital and is doing well after passing out at an event in honor he had earlier tonight. Now, Cianci was at City Hall for the official unveiling of his portrait when he apparently passed out and was taken to the hospital by ambulance. Eyewitness News reporter Shante Lance spoke to the former mayor a few hours ago. She joins us now with more live from the Providence Mobile Newsroom. Mike and Shannon, right after former Providence Mayor Buddy C. Ancy left Rhode Island Hospital, he came here to Federal Hill. He says he's fine. He just got a little dehydrated. Former Providence Mayor Buddy C. Ancy is rushed in a wheelchair and placed into an ambulance after appearing to have fainted during his own portrait unveiling ceremony. I was shocked. Longtime friend John Oakes was inside City Hall's third floor alderman chambers with C. Ancy. Yeah. Going to have a good time, something happens, you know. But that something turned out okay. Buddy is back at it, eating dinner on Federal Hill at Via Roma. The capital city's longest running mayor was treated and released from Rhode Island Hospital after one hour. I'm fine. I was a little dehydrated. Um, the room was hot and I was dehydrated. I finished my speech and I just sat down afterwards and I guess I got a little bit uh, uh, dehydrated and uh, so I didn't, I didn't pass out, I don't think. Buddy Cianci's grandson, Joseph, was on his way to the ceremony when Buddy was taken away. I'm not really concerned. I saw him beat cancer. All he did was faint. I don't want people worrying about it. I'm back eating and looking forward to having my pasta. And we spoke to Buddy Cianci for just a few minutes, and we in fact left so we can let him get back to his dinner. Reporting live in Providence on Federal Hill with the Mobile Newsroom, Shante Lands, Eyewitness News.